Hello guys, this is Indian Medico and in this video, we are going to see about congenital dacryo cystitis. This is a concise presentation for medical students. Dacryon means tear, cystam means sac and itis means inflammation. So, dacryo cystitis literally means inflammation of the tear sac. Dacryo cystitis is an infection or inflammation of the lacrimal sac secondary to obstruction of the nasolacrimal duct at the junction of nasolacrimal sac. Congenital dacryo cystitis is an inflammation of the lacrimal sac in newborn infants. It is also known as dacryocystitis neonatorum. Now let us see about the etiology of congenital dacryocystitis. Congenital dacryocystitis is due to incomplete canalization of the lacrimal system, most often the valve of Eisner. It follows stasis of secretions in the lacrimal sac due to congenital blockage in the nasolacrimal duct. The common organisms implicated in congenital dacryocystitis are Staphylococcus aureus, Haemophilus influenzae, beta hemolytic streptococci and pneumococci. Now, what are the clinical features of congenital dacryocystitis? There will be epiphora, that is, excessive watering of the eyes. Regurgitation test is positive, that is, when pressure is applied over the lacrimal sac area, purulent discharge regurgitates from the lower punctum. There will be swelling on the sac. This is how a patient with congenital dacryocystitis presents to you. What are the differential diagnosis of congenital dacryocystitis? There will be wa watering of eyes in other conditions like ophthalmia neonatorum and congenital glaucoma. It is necessary that you distinguish congenital dacryocystitis from these conditions. What are the complications of congenital dacryocystitis? Congenital dacryocystitis, if not adequately treated, can lead to recurrent conjunctivitis, acute or chronic dacryocystitis, lacrimal abscess, and fistulae formation. How do you treat a case of congenital dacryocystitis? Massage over the lacrimal sac and topical antibiotics are the treatment of choice. Lacrimal syringing, that is irrigation with normal saline and antibiotic solution can be tried. Probing of nasolacrimal duct with Bowman's probe can be done after one year of age. Balloon catheter dilation can be done if probing fails. Intubation with silicone tube can also be done. Dacryocystorhinostomy DCR operation can be done after four years of age. Thank you.